it makes me feel that if they had moved in any type of way, then she would have shot and killed my boys and maybe their friends. A father tells me his two teenagers and their friends were just trying to raise money for a fundraiser. They decide to stop by Morningside Drive after football practice at Wynn High School. He says instead of selling discount cards, their lives were threatened when a woman pointed a gun at them. Yes, yeah, she racially profiled them because, I mean, why would they look suspicious and you had a construction crew up the road doing construction? The father doesn't want to show his face or tell us his name because he's afraid of retaliation. When police tell me the woman who pointed the gun at the teens is Jerry Kelly. She is the wife of the Cross County Jail Administrator. She kept asking them, um, do you know who the hell I am? Do you know who I am? This happened on Wednesday morning. Investigators say they responded to a call about suspicious persons and found Kelly pointing a gun at four teens lying on the ground outside her home. A grandparent tells me her grandson thought he was going to die. She put the gun right at my head and he said, I made peace with God that if I die, that I make it to heaven. Kelly's brother, Alan Hawley, says his sister felt threatened. He told me on the phone she is disabled and has severe seizures. On Monday, she was arrested for endangering the welfare of a minor in other charges. She's now out on bond. The father tells me he hopes this is a wake up call for the city of Wynn that this type of stuff is going on and it is alive and well where we live um, and it needs to stop.